to create this design i'm going to add a circle and i will go with 24 volts in this way after getting the circle i'm going to add a curve add a bezier curve then i'm going to scale this curve select this handle and s y 0 select it and move it like this give the position to this handle So after giving the right position to the words of the curve, shift D to duplicate it and then select this word and give the position like this. Now just adjust the position of the word like this. Now I will select the first curve and I will adjust the position of the word. So in this way I am going to get a design. Then select this bottom curve and decrease its resolution to 8 and this 12 is fine. Then select these two and convert them to the mesh. Now select this and select this word and E to extrude it. Then extrude one more time and then select these words and X to delete them. Then select these words and move them like this. Then select this word and control X to dissolve it. Just adjust the position a little bit. Then delete this word okay after that you can select all these edges and join them and then you can select everything press m and merge by distance so double words will get merged now here is only one word then select this word select this word and press m merge at last add new word at here like this you will get this kind of design which is looking really well then you can select everything and then press F to fill this gap. Then I am going to add one more circle with the same vertex count 24 and I am going to scale it down like this. Go to the read more, select all words and press F to fill the gap and extrude it in this way. G and Z, move it along the Z axis. Then select both the objects and use the boolean operation difference in this way. Then apply the boolean modifier and delete the cutter object like this. Now select these words and press J to connect them. Select these words, press J to connect them. Then select these faces and delete only faces. Delete this edge. Then select this edge loop and select this edge loop. Right click bridge edge loop in this way. Then create a cut like this. In this way you can create cuts, so you can connect the words and you can create a good topology. Then select these words and remove them. Then select everything and use the insert operation. Like this. And then select this edge loop, Control X to dissolve it. And select these words and press M. Merge at center. Then select this edge loop and remove them in this way. Then select this edge and control X to dissolve it. Select this edge, control X to dissolve it. Then select this edge and control X to dissolve it. Now select this word and move it in this way. Then select this edge loop and press F to fill the gap and use the insert operation in this way and delete this face. After that, select this word and connect it in this way. Then create a cut here and then dissolve this edge. Then select everything and extrude it along the Z axis. Then select everything, move it along the Z axis. Then select everything, mesh and symmetry rights. Take the symmetry along the Z axis. Then check the face orientation. Then select everything and then press Alt and recalculate the normal. After that, select this edge loop and this edge loop. Deselect these edges and Control B add bevel in this way. Then select these edges and add bevel like this. Then select these words 
Press M, merge at last In this way Same thing here also Then select everything, mesh, symmetrites Take the symmetry along the z-axis Select this edge loop and select this edge loop Ctrl X to dissolve it Then select these faces and then delete them Then add one loop cut at here, add one loop cut at here Then select these edge loops and use set flow on them Select this edge loop and use set flow on it Like this Then hit the Ctrl 2 to add the subd modifier And shade smooth it So now you can see then select this word and double tap G for the edge slide Then use the knife tool and create cut like this Then use the knife tool and create cuts In this way And create topology like this I know the topology is little glitchy here Then I will try to maintain good topology to find some solutions Then select everything, mesh, symmetrize, take the symmetry and add one loop cut at here In just I'm trying to make a corbis topology then select this each loop and control B add bevel on it Add a two segment bevel like this And then select everything mesh symmetrize take the symmetry Then select this H control X to dissolve it You can remove this edges and you will get little even topology I'm going to use the knife tool at here and I will create a cut like this And I will connect this in this way and then dissolve this and select everything mesh symmetrize refine the topology as much as you can then select this H and press F to fill the gap use the insert operation and use the one more time the insert operation and just merge these words press M merge at center then select everything mesh symmetrize and select this H and add bevel on it in this way Okay, pretty cool Then add one loop cut at here And create cut Like this Select this words, press M, merge at center Select this words, press M, merge at center Now you can see And then turn go to the matte cap view, turn on the cavity and you can see The design so this is how you can create this kind of design So that's it for today, thanks for watching If you like this tutorial then hit that like button and subscribe to the channel Bye bye, see the next video, take care